good morning guys so we have the electrician coming around today um which means obviously like a lot of the sockets and lights and stuff will be turned off um and rather than sitting around doing nothing because i can't really do any work or anything like that i am gonna take a trip to home sense i have not been to home sense since we moved in here i don't think we've i don't think i've been to home sense since like december i think i went around christmas time but i thought i would just go you know have a little browse see if there's anything in there i always say this about home sense but i feel like when you go you can't look for anything and you can't expect to get anything oh my god it's so messy back there ignore that um yeah so i'm just gonna go and like have a bit of a rouse if anything takes my fancy then obviously i'll get it but i'm mainly just going to have a look at stuff you know what i mean so i thought i would take you guys along with me this isn't the first time that i have been to this home sense because when we came and did like um a recce of different areas when we were looking to move here we um went to that home sense turns out it's only like just down the road from us so that's really handy um so yeah i'm gonna take you guys with me show you some stuff that's in store what's new i don't really know what to expect because i feel like it's too early for spring stuff but maybe they'll have some spring stuff so we shall see left to see you broke my heart in two now I'm stuck looking for you what you do to me maybe it's my dignity you made me rip that whole apart now and now I'm begging on my What you do to me There's nothing left to see You left me in the dark now Don't come be fake with me What I do to you
I'm sorry to my friends. Maybe I'm looking for me or what I used to be. And I'm like, hey, oh, baby, hey, hey, whoa. you do to me there's nothing left to see you left me in the dark now and I'm blended with disease but what you do to me maybe it's my dignity
what you do to me There's nothing left to see You broke my heart in two Now I'm stuck looking for you What you do to me Maybe it's my dignity You made me rip that whole love apart now And now I'm begging on my knees What you do to me There's nothing left to see Left me in the dark now Don't come be fake with me What I do to you Oh baby what I do to you And I'm like I Right guys, so the electricians have now left and I wanted to show you what I got from HomeSense this morning. If you can hear that clicking noise, I don't know if you can or not, it's like the radiator turning on. <laughs> it's making a weird clicking noise. So I got a few bits from HomeSense, nothing too big or out there. Um, we don't really have a lot of space to put stuff at the moment because obviously we've got a lot going on in the house so i need to make sure i was careful with what i did buy um in terms of stuff in store so much nice outdoor stuff annoyingly there was a massive clip i've just edited a bit of the footage there was a massive clip that i filmed because they had so many like fire pits in store and i forgot to press record obviously because i couldn't find footage um but yeah loads of like hanging swinging egg chair things loads of fire pits cute little outdoor sets really nice big planters for pretty good prices as well um lots of that they did have some spring stuff but it was all very like bright colorful stuff that i think was more aimed towards kids um but yeah loads of nice stuff in store as per usual so i got a few bits um first thing i got i always pick up something for the dogs they had loads of these kind of raw natural treats so i grabbed some of these pet munchies 100 percent natural dog treats salmon fillets i gave them one of these each when i got back and they went mad for them they absolutely loved them um two pound 49 for a packet i'm not sure how many is actually in there but anyway i thought it was like a nice little treat to give them they're quite smelly i'm that's no surprise because they're fish treats but they do smell kind of bad another thing i got this is quite unlike me but i saw they had these dog food bowl placemat things so i saw this one has like whiff on it it's just like a little kind of jute map map mat on this side it's a kind of like beigey color but I kind of thought like I don't really get the point of having the design if you put the bowls on it because it says woof and like if you put a bowl on it you're not gonna see that anyway but the reverse side of it is actually white and it's just plain in this bone shape so it still looks nice it's kind of like reversible it's just slightly darker on that side I kind of thought I would use this upside down um because I just wanted something nice like I don't know just to kind of put the bowls on so this is by a brand called tahari this was only five pounds i thought it was cute obviously we've got two dogs so i thought i could put their water bowl in the middle and then put their food bowls on each side 
and that would be quite sweet. Right, my camera just ran out of battery. Um, next thing I got, they had loads of stuff on clearance, kind of like throughout the store. I, this isn't for you. The salmon treats are up there. Um, this is by Home Living, GeoSense. Oh, Wick and Vessel, that's the brand that I recognise. They had loads of these. Um, it's just a room spray. It says that it's infused with rose quartz. Um, so I don't know if you can see, there's like little quartz stone things in the bottom there. Um, do I think that makes a difference? No, but I thought it looked quite nice. This is pink grapefruit and juniper. It smells so, so nice. I was kind of looking for like a just really nice kind of room spray. It's in a nice glass bottle smells really good they had a blue one as well i went for the pinky one so it's four pounds in the clearance i think that's like super cheap for something in the clearance but i liked it anyway and the last thing i got it's not very interesting this stuff but i saw these cushions obviously we are working on steve's office at the moment I've kind of said this briefly before, but there will be a sofa bed in Steve's office so it can double up as a spare room as well. And I wanted to make sure that it didn't kind of look really officey, if that makes sense. I want it to look nice and kind of welcoming in there as well. Steve does a lot of filming, so having kind of like soft furnishings like this is good for like the acoustics in the room. That's what I tell him anyway. Um, they had like four of these. I thought they were really cool. It's like, um, they're really nice, kind of like textured. You have this natural color, as well as this kind of dark blackish gray. If you guys haven't seen the videos already, this is pretty much the color of the room. So I thought this would be like a good addition to kind of lighten it up a little bit, add a bit of texture. Um, and I thought it was like a nice feminine touch, but it's also kind of masculine. So I was toying with the idea of getting two. Um, they also have cute little tassels on them as well. Um, I was toying with the idea of getting two because when these were on the shelf, one of them was like flipped the other way. And I kid you not, I thought it was like a different style of cushion. Probably because I'm stupid, but like, it's a good way to kind of mix and match them because you can kind of alternate which way they are if you want to get more than one. I did just stick with the one for now. Um, they are from a brand called Artelier, Artelier by Nicole Miller. Um, so it's 15 quid for the cover and the cushion insert. Um, I don't think that's bad pricing at all. I think that's pretty good. They feel really, really good quality. And also the cushion insert is nice and poofy. Sometimes I feel like when you buy a cushion with an insert, sometimes the insert can be a little bit flat but these are super big poofy cushions. So that'll be styled up in the office, hopefully within the next couple of weeks, the next week or two. We shall see, we shall see. But those are my little finds. Um, things that I was kind of, oh my gosh, what's going on? Um, things that I was kind of on the lookout for is, I'm toying with the idea of like a Ottoman storage bench for the hallway, just for some extra storage. Um, HomeSense seemed to have really good ones. I didn't see anything that I was in love with this time. Just cute little accessory bits and like little bits of furniture was mainly what I was looking at. That's everything I picked up. Um, hopefully I filmed enough to kind of give you guys a proper look as to what is in store at the moment. Um, if anyone wants to know, I went to the one in Cardiff and I can't remember the name of the area. It's like North Cardiff. Um, yeah, anyway, I'm going to stop waffling on now. We've got loads more stuff coming up in the house. Like I said, we're going to be finishing off the office very soon. We've had lots of electric stuff done in the house today. We have more electrical stuff going on in the house tomorrow as well. And what have we got? Someone doing the radiators the day after. So there'll be loads to update you guys on soon. If you haven't already subscribed, don't forget to subscribe for more kind of like home renovation content and I will catch you guys in the next one.